Hello everyone, my name is Steve and this is a brief video intended to show some of the newly implemented changes to the Newegg.com faceted search interface. So let's say we're looking for a desktop video card. Let me go ahead and take us to that category and click desktop graphics cards here. Now nothing up until this point has been changed. The faceted search is actually here on the left hand column. And first off, you might actually notice that the advanced search has been removed. Uh, what we've actually done is merge the guided search and the advanced search together in an effort to provide a visual listing for all of the filtering options. Now selecting any of these checkboxes will actually specify the exact properties of the graphics card you want to purchase. Uh, visually it may not seem very different, but functionally you can now select specific properties from multiple groups as well as within a group. Uh, let, me, uh, let me just show you here, you actually have a ton of options. I want to get down to the bottom and show you guys the two newest ones that have been added. Uh, we have the seller and the customer ratings. Uh, now it is possible to select multiple uh, marketplace sellers and restrict the results to his or her items only. You can also choose items sold strictly from Newegg by clicking here or at the top right here. But let's say you want an R9 series GPU. So let me go ahead and select that. And as you can see, the group expands to show all the options available. Uh, well, under the old guided search, you were limited. Here you can select multiple R9 series cards and it will dynamically show the results over here. Let me go ahead and remove one of them just to show you. This is something you couldn't do in the old guided search. I've removed the 290s. There's a total of 11 cards that were there and my new results are here. Uh, now let me go ahead and make another change. Let's say uh, we're going to add a price range of $200 to $300. A uh, total of 17 cards are uh, fulfilling that requirement uh, that are also R9 series, leaving us with all 17 270Xs here. Uh, then of course we could also remove these different facets and it would change the results on the fly as well as reset it back to its uh, original defaults. So what if you wanted a GTX 700 series card? So let me go ahead and bring that up. Now let's also sort it by best rating. And if I scroll down here to click more options, uh, it will actually show the full gambit of properties uh, to choose from while omitting the ones that don't apply to this particular set. Uh, because remember, for instance, I've chosen the NVIDIA based cards uh, which basically means it's only going to support SLI, which is why Crossfire is not showing up here. Remember that these search results are now saved as code in the URL, which means you can also bookmark or, or share your customized search page with your friends and family by simply copy and pasting it into your favorite social media site uh, or email. Don't forget also that they have the customer ratings here. So if I wanted to just see the ones that were five eggs, there's a total of 59 of them, and I'll go ahead and click that box now and show you that resultant. Now, if you don't like change, you can always fall back to our power search. And aside from adding the price range checkboxes here, this page hasn't changed, and it's still a really fast way to find what you're looking for on Newegg.com. So that's gonna wrap up this video, everyone. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you soon.